What's going on YouTube? It's your show you're talking about aka the Professor on the Sticks in the last season of Plain Mutt. I'm showing you every single game. We're 4 0, trying to go 5 0. Maybe we can have a perfect season. Let's let's just try for that for this uh this finale as you would say. Um Right here, oof, that was so close to getting picked. This game is a really close game. You definitely want to stay tuned. My opponent definitely knows what he's doing. Um, he almost got picked out, picked off on that second down play. Uh, nice little run here. Let's see what else he's doing. All right, he's gonna run a little base play. I uh, can't really run to the right side on that defense though. Got a little play action, a little trips formation from the left. I sent a dual edge on fourth down and five. And he hits me in the flats and makes my uh, makes a nice little juke move and gets a touchdown. So I had two different opportunities there. I felt like to be able to get a stop, and I did a, just a terrible, terrible job. I probably shouldn't have blitzed on that fourth and five. Um, and then he was able to convert. Uh, I almost picked him off as well on one second down. So anyways, I get a first down, first and ten. Uh, my guys, come on, look at Jerry Rice, man, pancaking somebody, then moving on to the next level. I like it. So right here, screen pass. Oh man, that could have gone for a touchdown real, real quick. I don't know how Ray Rice tripped over that tackle. You get a nice little seven yard gain as well. Uh, someone was asking where uh, Barry Sanders was. I'm letting, I was borrow, letting someone borrow him. And <laughs> look at this, third and three, and make a terrible read. I'm gonna pay for it. Going down 14, diving in the end zone. Good job, buddy. Um, just a bad read. That's exactly what it is. Just a bad read. And what's so frustrating is he scored, and then you know, you know, I worked to go all the way down the field, and look at that dot. Work to get all the way down the field, and I throw a pick because I make a bad read. <laughs> it's pathetic, man. I hate when I make bad reads. So he's playing. He's, you know, my opponent is good. He's playing some coverage defense. He's mixing in some blitzes every once in a while. Uh, third and goal, nothing there. So now it's fourth and goal. I run a toss play, and I'm able to get in for a touchdown, <coughs> which was huge. Um, I'm going for two again. Oh yeah, because he was trying to block my extra point. So I went for two because uh, I was only at the one yard line. He ran commit again, so I was able to toss to work a second time. And now I'm coming out with some good defense to in, try to end the half. And he hits me with a <laughs> small route out route on third 19, which I double covered. But uh, I should have put a purple out there instead of manning him up twice. And that could have easily been a pick. And right there should have been picked again. So I've had two chances where my well, my first chance was I was just a half a second behind. The second time was um, I just over overran the play a little bit, which is definitely very frustrating. So I'm playing pretty good defense. He's just he's making some good reads. He's getting a little lucky. And uh, right there, like <laughs> that's that's a pick, man. That should have been picked. And then he's throwing. Out you know, I have a purple route right there to stop it or pick it off, but instead he gets a completion. However, he was out of timeouts and he didn't get it in the next playoff. I should have probably edited that in the video, but uh, my bad there. So I was able to end up getting a stop there at the end of the half. Get the ball start to start the third quarter, so um, made a couple not the best reads, but I was able to get away with it. And now I'm trying to hit him up with the screen pass. Um, I was out, it was almost a good play call, but uh, his DN was able to uh, peel off and uh, get a stop. Here we are with the little sweet play out of bunch. The bunch sweet play is really nice. Um, it's one of the better run plays in the game. A nice little block shed he had. So now it's second 19. He's playing coverage defense, but he's getting some really nice block sheds, and so it's kind of disturbing me a little bit on offense, getting me out of rhythm. Uh, you know, I definitely need to do a better job of, of handling that pressure. So now third and 11, I make it I make it manageable for fourth down, but uh, I decided to just... Uh, take my points, make it a three-point game. So if I can get a stop, I can at least send it over time. If I don't get the, uh, if I can't get a touchdown, but mainly I just need to get a stop. So he's going to try to clock me here. As you can see, he's just snapping with 10 seconds left, running it up. Uh, second A, I just got to get one stop. He runs a toss. I do a good job of containing the outside and blowing it up. So now it's third and A. I got to get a stop. Playing some coverage defense and he hits me with an out route. I sh I knew that I should have known that was coming. That. Especially looking back now, I, that's, that was the one route I had to take away. So right here, I'm taking away the out route, but uh, he somehow managed to get that corner route off. I don't know how that pass got off, but um, it is what it is. And that's going to wrap it up. I could not get a crucial stop any time throughout this game, and I'm going to come out with the L. No perfect season. See you on the